My name's Josh, and I'm playing young Bill. I'm Jeremy, and I'm playing young Sam. I'm Hugh, and I'm playing young Harry. Dylan, Colin, and Pierce all have very distinct voices and character things that, as an actor coming to play sort of like the younger versions of them, it's great. This dress might look very pretty on. You really don't know me at all, do you? I was very daunted to be following in the footsteps of Colin Firth, but no, it's, it's great to be sharing a part with him. Bill, he kind of does it all. So the job I have is very, very fun and enjoyable because I get to sort of try and show how he came to be the guy you see in the first film. John Vaughan, I'm Bill. He's very, very adventurous. He's definitely a free spirit. He's afraid of commitment, I think that would be fair to say. And he's fun-loving. It's kind of the best part ever. It's lucky this trip is not long enough for my fragile heart to shatter completely when you leave my boat. We're literally throwing everything at this bad boy. Just a movie all about happiness and joy. So I don't think it gets better than this. Mama mia. Hey, so did you like that video? Do you think the movie is worthy of an Academy Award? Well, did you know that only three movies have swept all five major Academy Awards, winning for Best Picture, Best Actor, Best Actress, Best Director and Best Screenplay Adaptation. The first was Frank Capra's It Happened One Night from 1934, starring Clark Gable and Claudette Colbert. The second movie is Milos Forman's One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest from 1975, starring Jack Nicholson and Louise Fletcher. And the third movie is Jonathan Demme's Silence of the Lambs from 1991, starring Sir Anthony Hopkins and Jodie Foster. Do you think these movies deserved all five awards? Let me know below. And remember, we publish new videos every day, so be sure to subscribe for more great content. See ya!